Okay, so we're here at our desktop, and if you go up here to the view menu at the top in full screen mode, we'll just say switch. Notice that it doesn't take the entire screen. So what we wanna do is install the guest editions image. So if we go back, we go up to devices, and then insert guest edition CD image. We'll get a disk over here for that. Let's open it up. So we have it right over here. We can click on the run software option and it's gonna ask us if we want to run it. We'll go ahead and click on that. And it's gonna require our password. It's gonna be the same password that we had created. And now it's ready to install it. So we'll just say yes. Okay, so that is installed, it resized it here. It looks a little bit weird, let me just stretch it out. What we need to do in order for this to work properly is just make sure that we restart the system. It's not required right now because you can see that I can stretch it, but to make sure that everything is installed properly, we'll just do a quick reboot. All right, so we're back at the login screen. I'm just gonna go ahead and put in my password. And we're back at the desktop. Now what we're gonna do is go up to the view menu at the top and then enter in full screen mode, click on switch. And there you go, it's completely stretched out. It takes up the entire screen and that's what we're looking for. So we've completed the installation of guest editions on a Windows 11 PC with VirtualBox 7. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please smash that like button. Thank you for watching, catch you on the next one.